Hi guys and welcome to my tutorial. Uh, today's tutorial I'll be going over this Wii system menu once more. Uh, this is like you could say the third part of going over this stuff. Um, the first tutorial that I did I was going over on how to install uh, custom uh, Wii system menu themes on your Wii. Um, the second one was going over on how to take an MYM file and convert it over to a CSM file uh, for, for the 4.3 uh, version system menus on the Wii. Uh, this time around, uh, instead of uh, showing you how to install custom themes, I'm going to show you how to actually re revert back to the original system menu that come with your Wii. Actually, so uh, that's what I'm going to be doing. Uh, bear with me guys, uh, my controller here is not working too well. It's about to die on me. Uh, it will stay on about three seconds. That's it. Tops. Uh, I've actually went through, this is my third one, uh, this is my first one, it's dead, this is my favorite one, gone, history, I don't know what's wrong with that stupid thing, uh, this was the second one, this is to my other Wii, uh, it's dead, gone, I don't know what's wrong with it either, <clears throat> and now this one, it's fixing to die on me, so I hope it makes it through the tutorial, I don't know, or we'll see, but let's hop over to the computer guys, and I'll, I'll, I'll show you how to uh, get everything up and going, all right? So uh, let's do this. Mm. Okay, guys, so uh, we're going to go ahead and grab up our file that we're going to need. Uh, now, the program we're going to need is called NUS Downloader. That's the only program that we're going to need for this, guys. Pretty simple. It really is. It's not that hard. You go ahead and save it to the desktop. Ah. In the world is it? Okay. All right. We'll go ahead and extract it. Okay, <clears throat> go ahead and extract our program here. And we'll start the program up. Okay, now, this is our program here. Uh, what you want to do is go down here and uh, check off PackWad and also create encrypted content. Make sure that's checked off also. Uh, go up here to database, go to system, and you want to scroll down to where it says system menu, and then here's all your different versions right here. Um, I'm working with the 4.3U right now, so uh, I picked this one right here. Um, you guys who live in Japan or uh, Europe or Korea or whatever, you would check off, uh, you select one of these other uh, 4.3 versions here it was a 4.3 J here here's E and there's K there but like I said I, I mean I live in the US so I'm going with the 4.3 U okay once you do that uh, just go up here and you hit start <clears throat> and you just wait on it and what we're going to need to do is open this folder back up because we gotta, it, it created two file uh, folders here well, once we started it up, uh, your files are going to be in this titles folder right here. Just wait on that for a second. Okay, so uh, that's all done. I'll go into the titles folder right here. That's where we're going to have quite a few uh, different apps right here. Uh, actually need to go back for a second hold on one second guys I'll go on it okay I gotta open this up once more. I did this in the last uh, tutorial I went over this right here but I'm gonna go over it again okay we have different different types of apps here um, NTSCU this is for people in the US all right uh, NTSCJ is for the people who live in Japan and PAL E right here is for people who live in Europe. I don't know why there's nothing for Korea. I have no earthly idea. But um, all these different apps under this right here, this is what I'm going to be looking at, guys. Oh, golly, what am I doing? Okay. Uh, depending on what version that you went with, I went with a 4.3. So, guys, this is the app that I'm going to be looking for in my folder here, which is right here. All right. Those of you who live in Japan, if you picked a 4.3, you'd be looking for the 94.app uh, file. If you live in uh, Europe, 
you're looking for the non a dot app file. Alright, here's your other version. You got the 3.2, 4.0, and on down, you know. But <clears throat> we're just looking at this bottom bottom line here for the 4.3, depending on where you're at. Alright, so that's that. Uh, what I'm going to do, you simply just going to cut this out, guys. And uh, uh -oh. on your SD card, just go into wherever you store your uh, custom themes or whatever. Mine's in the uh, CSM folder here. And just just paste it right in there just like that and that's it that's the only app we're going to need guys and now we'll hop over to the uh, the Wii and I'll show you I'll show you how to uh, revert back to the original system menu all right guys uh, so let's get started here wish me luck working with this uh, controller here uh, <laughs> okay anyway there it goes. See, it went off already. Doggone it. Hold on, guys. I'm trying to work with this controller here. Um, let's see. We need to go into my menu file right here. And it went off again. Okay. Okay, so we're going to be looking for these. This is the. Hold on, guys. My controller here is really screwing up. CSM folder right here. That's where my uh, app. Oh, crap. All right, so this is the file that I had uh, created by Nuts Downloader. And uh, my controller, it, it's just not going to work, guys. This controller is gone just about. 97.app file. This is the one that I had created, guys with the nuts downloader and so that's what I'm going to uh, use so you just click on it hit yes complete now it says what now we're just going to exit and you should be back to your original system menu guys And there we go. <clears throat> this is the original. And so I hope this helped you out, guys. Uh, like I said, I should have did this in my last tutorial. Actually, the very first tutorial I should have did this in, actually. So, yeah, uh, that's it, guys. If you want to revert back to your old system menu, that's how you do it. So, uh, <clears throat> I'm going to end the tutorial here and let, let y'all have it. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. And uh, tune in for uh, more tutorials on down the road. Uh, as soon as I get my Wiimote, uh, I actually got a black one coming, which is going to be pretty cool. Uh, so hopefully that will work a little better. So until then, guys, uh, it's Bobby signing off, and y'all have a good day. All right.